There is a new study out, and the headlines read, Root Canals May Do More Than Save Teeth. They could boost your overall health. Researchers found significant drops in inflammation markers and diabetes risk factors. Now, that certainly is a headline grabber. But the benefit I have of spending 25 years in basic science and research and writing papers, reviewing papers, understanding the data, and then making the proper interpretation of the data. Let's see what they're doing here. Root canals are typically done on infected teeth. So you go into the dentist, you have a toothache. Their solution is to remove the nerve from that tooth so you no longer feel the pain. And then they actually remove the blood supply from that tooth. So now it's isolated from your immune system. It's isolated from your cardiovascular system. And then they put you on an oral antibiotic post root canal. But the dentist must have forgotten that they've removed the blood supply to that tooth. So an oral antibiotic is not gonna reach the infection. So now what happens, and these studies were done looking at two years after a root canal, isolated from your cardiovascular system. So of course you're not gonna have markers of inflammation. The inflammation is gonna go down. So then obviously diabetic risk factors are gonna go down. Inflammation is the driver of most chronic disease. So these results aren't that surprising to me, but it's a gross misinterpretation because now you have a dead tooth in your body. You have an infection. Now it's an asymptomatic infection. You still have the same infection, you just can't feel it. So long-term, what we're finding is that if you leave a dead body part in the body for an extended period of time, you develop chronic illness. And these bacteria, these phanerobes are sitting there respiring, they're chewing on your jawbone, decaying it, leads to osteonecrosis of the jaw. It can actually lead to decay up into the sinuses, chronic sinus infections. And now you've probably heard me say over the many years that root canals are linked to many cancers. In fact, every tooth is connected to an organ. If you have a root canal tooth and there's no nerve conductance through there, there's no nerve supply, there's no conductance, then organs on that meridian fail. They develop low pH, low voltage, and low oxygen. We call that the Warburg effect. It's the hallmarks of cancer. So I think it's worth talking about this study because it just came out. It was on Fox News headlines. I had a lot of people send this to me, and I thought it was worth commenting because don't let the headlines grab your attention and have enough sense to make a proper interpretation of what they're trying to communicate to you because media is in the business of grabbing your attention that's why there's these headlines. But when you dig down, when you delve down into the science, most of the time the headlines don't match the actual proper interpretation of data. So don't be fooled. Root canals do not improve your health. In fact, they lead to the demise of your health. If you have a toothache, dentist wants to recommend a root canal, fire that dentist, go find a new dentist, a biological dentist. You can find really good dentists at IOAMT.org or IABDM.org.